Hey guys, here's Camera iPod PC, and I'm gonna show you how to update your iPod Touch iPhone on for iOS 4.0. So, how you see here, there is a new like if you go on iPod on your iTunes, and let's I don't even know what iTunes I have. That's pretty bad. Yeah, so um, there is a new iPod 4.0 software alright you can just install that but first you need three things iTunes and you need the new one 9.2 then you need um, your sure your iPhone iPod 2.0 firmware I give you a link and um, how where you can um, get the Newest one. All right. Um. Whoops. Go to Chip Online. Here you can have iOS. iOS four, and there is a download. You can have it for three G, S or here for iPod two G, I iPod Touch three G. Um. Yeah. The jailbreak and unlock, I will do that next time in the next video. It'll come out today, tomorrow, I don't even know. So, when this thing backs up and finished synchronizing, I gonna install the new iTunes. So, see you in a second. Alright, it finished synchronizing. Oh, no, it didn't syn finish synchronizing. Yet yeah, now, now. It finished synchronizing, and now I gonna close up iTunes. I gonna go here and launch the 64 bit setup. That just needs a second, and there it is. Run. I think it's pretty easy to install. Um, repair, remove. Alright, I already have the version. Just go through the installation and um, install iTunes. So I already got it. That was amazing because I didn't really know I got it. So, yeah. Mm. Okay, the new software version 4.0 is on it. I could just load it and install it, but I don't really like it. Let's just load it. Oops. Okay, I'll, you know what, I'll just load it in here, and I'll cancel the download right here, cancel. So, he's backupping my iPod, that's really important, and it just needs a while to download this new version. I'm gonna come back when this version is finished and download it, so see you in Alright, just a couple more seconds, 39. 38. So let's wait for the software to finish. And um, what I want to say, you can um, get the you can get the firmware in many um, versions. Like for iPod, you can download them directly in the internet or over iTunes. I just do it over iTunes. So see you in a second when it's finished. Okay, und hier sind wir fertig. Unsere Firmware ist runtergeladen und fertig zum Aufbau. So, jetzt könnte ich hier Doppelklick... Ne, Doppelklick funktioniert nicht. Also gehen wir hier Aktualisieren. Und jetzt drücke ich hier Aktualisieren. Mein iPhone, äh, mein iPod wird jetzt synchronisiert. Ich habe es schon gejailbreakt davor auf 3 Punkt. Ach, oh, ich weiß, ich habe nicht mehr. Na, ich habe es gejailbreakt und ähm, ja, 3.1.3. Ich glaube, das ist sogar noch ziemlich, ziemlich alt. Und naja, jetzt mache ich ein Backup, dann wird synchronisiert und dann wird neu installiert. Im nächsten Video mache ich ein kleinen Review, wie das neue iPhone oder de, die neue Firmware 4G ist. Und ganz am Ende werde ich dann noch ähm, einen Jailbreak machen. Ich versuche alle Videos heute noch fertigzustellen, so dass dann viele, viele Klicks auf meine Videos kommen. Genau. Und glaubt mir, die neue Firmware. Ist nicht schlecht, ich habe sie schon bei meiner Mutter installiert und genau. 
Also, ich komme wieder, wenn der iPod fertig ist. Bis nachher. Okay, that looks bad, because I'm like an hour now away, and the backup didn't really finish, so I just gonna keep on doing that, and hopefully it'll get better in a few seconds. So see you now. See you. Not in a sec, but later on. Okay, it gets better, but one important thing always to know about is whatever the iPod screen is doing. Don't disconnect the iPod. Don't press any buttons. Don't do anything like that. Just let it wait and wait, and it'll get better. And even if there's the really bad sign on it, just let it go. That's important. So, see. You know. Okay, guys. Um, how you see here, I'm on 4.0 version. My firmware is updated, and now we're coming to the review.